Good morning from Costa Rica. Totally woke up like this, but OMG, I can finally show you outside. There's actually a mosquito net like covering here and some trees, but look at this, guys. <gasps> it's the beach. OMG. I'm like, how close can I get to the mosquito net? I can hear the waves. The beach is like there. That is sand right there. I cannot wait to explore today. I'm so excited. I'm gonna go and get ready and then go meet the girls for breakfast. I literally cannot wait. This looks amazing. So I thought I would do a quick outfit of the day. Before I head out, I've just thrown my hair into like a side ponytail and put some beach spray in it because it's gonna get all kind of sandy and sea salty. Um, my sunglasses are from Key by, is it Crispy? She's a YouTuber. Um, but yeah, they're like rose gold, really. I really, really like these. Um, and then I have on this jumpsuit. It's like a denim. It looks like denim, but it's actually not denim. It's kind of like a light denim. And I wish it had pockets. It really annoys me that it doesn't have pockets from River Island. And then I have on my Valentino flat. And then I'm taking my Kate Spade bag, which is propping the mirror open because it moves, um, which has like pom-poms and stuff on it. That is all. Let's go and get some breakfast. So we just sat down to breakfast. I actually had some eggs there, but I ate them and I thought I better vlog before I eat the rest of it. I've got like a chicken frittata thing, which I've had a little taste of. It's kind of good. I'm not entirely sure what this is. Some kind of like cakey, tasty looking thing and some watermelon and some strawberries. There is a crazy, crazy buffet. So I feel like I may go up for seconds as well. I'm so hungry. And then I have this juice, which is like cucumber, kale, and something else that I can't remember. As we're walking down to the beach after breakfast, is this an iguana? Oh, oh my god, look at it, he's just chilling on the beach. Imagine if you were like sunbathing and that came and like jumped on you. Oh my god, look at him. You think he's dangerous? I don't think he's dangerous, he's just chilling. I just want to cuddle it. You, you could not cuddle that tomorrow. <laughs> look how beautiful it is, guys. It's actually quite sunny as well, we were expecting it to be like chucking it down with rain. This is one side, there's like a beach either side of the resort. There's one here and then there's one on the other side too. So we're gonna go and check it out and see where we're gonna make our home for the day. I'm on a sun lounger right now, soaking up the sun. We actually did not think it would be sunny. This is a bonus for us. We thought it was gonna be raining. So nice, look at this beach. There's like barely anybody on it either. Amazing, and we got iced coffees, all good. So we're sitting by the pool now. It's actually um, gone a little bit cloudy, but it's so nice, it's just nice and warm. And I've got a tuna burger for lunch, which looks so tasty. And these are yucca chips. I don't know what a yucca is, Apparently something quite similar to a potato, but they've got cheese all over them, so I am happy. So dinner crept up on me like I didn't even realise, <laughs> and I just had to get ready in like five minutes, so I sprayed some salt spray in my hair, and it's kind of worked. I feel like it's a good messy look, a little bit, maybe a little bit too messy. And then I've also got on, if you guys can see in this mirror, um, a black maxi dress. This is actually from River Island via ASOS, and I really like it. This is the worst lighting in the world, I don't quite know because of that big light there. Um, but yeah, so I'm wearing a black kind of silky maxi dress with this little belt, which is really old from All Saints. And then I have on my Valentino sandals as well. And I think I'm just gonna take my big white Kate Spade bag again because I need to put my camera in it because I think we're gonna do some filming. I'm gonna go and meet the girls. I'm late and I also burnt my shoulders today, which I'm really annoyed about because I put on Factor 50 everywhere, but I must have just like missed the top of my shoulders when I was putting it on myself. This is why you need Mike to do your shoulders and your back when you are on holiday. <laughs> um, so yeah, I've got red shoulders. Look, this one's really red. Ow. We're chilling, having a cocktail on our sofa, and Tamara has introduced us to this Instagram account called Pumpkin the Raccoon. I am not kidding you, it is the cutest thing. It is. Show everyone the pictures. I want a raccoon as a pet. <laughs> Go and follow him, guys. Pumpkin the raccoon. Coolest Instagram account ever. It's my new favorite. And as if Snapchat were reading my mind, there is now a twins, pumpkin. Long -lost. Twins is my long lost buddy. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I actually look pretty cute like that. I think it's an improvement. We just got to the dinner venue. Look at this, guys. It's so beautiful. And they have a steel band. Well, a steel band with a guitar. So amazing. This is the cutest layout ever. Look at this. This is an actual baby pineapple. An actual one. Spray painted gold. And look at my little friends. Hello. We also only just realized these are actually
Look at my dinner, guys. Oh my god, this looks so good. Surf and turf and some kind of potato cake, I think. I've just got back from dinner and I'm in my little princess mosquito net. I don't know why being in a mosquito net makes you feel like a princess, but it genuinely does, even though being in a mosquito net isn't very princessy. And I tell you what else is not princessy, these super sexy mosquito bracelets that I have on all four of my limbs. I have them around my ankles as well, guys, because I'm just that sexy. Um, if you guys don't know why I'm so kind of mosquito conscious, it's because of Zika virus. I'm not pregnant and I'm not trying to get pregnant. I know that is like the number one question that will come up as soon as I mention Zika, but um, yeah, there's kind of a little bit of an end, like a discrepancy about how long it stays in your system and blah, blah, blah. Some people um, say years and obviously like, I don't, I've spoken about this before in vlogs as well, like, and people always comment on it. Like, when are you having kids? Like, do you want kids and things like that? I don't want kids yet, but I do want kids in the next few years. So I'd rather not get Zika virus. So when I'm in Central America, as I am now, I am wearing very, very strong mosquito repellent and sleeping under a mosquito net and I have a mosquito plug-in and I have a mosquito thing um, on my window and I have bracelets on and I have a lot of mosquito repellent on my body as well. So hopefully not getting bitten by any mosquitoes whilst I'm here. I don't even know why I'm talking about mosquitoes now. I feel like it's been such a big part of my life for the past few days in planning on coming here. It's been like, how can I avoid getting bitten by mosquitoes? Um, so yeah, I had such a good dinner actually. It was so nice um, to catch up with a lot of people I haven't seen in a long time, a lot of the Style Hall staff who are awesome, um, really great team and a lot of other YouTubers as well. And yeah, we just had a few glasses of wine and dinner and had a really nice catch up. I'm now watching old YouTube videos. I don't even know why. I feel like we got talking about who we used to watch like back in the early days of YouTube and I'm going back and looking at like my favorite YouTubers from back in the day and like in 2010 or 2009 when I first started YouTube and like what people were like and how people have changed and it is hilarious. So if you guys have been watching YouTube for a long time, I would 100% recommend going back and watching what people were like because people change so much. It's not so much about like their personality changing, but like the way YouTube videos are presented has changed a lot. And like people just grow up as well, which is just really funny, funny. This is so funny to see. Anyway, that's gonna be it for today, guys. I hope you had a good day. Today hasn't been that um, crazy vlog-wise because we've just been kind of chilling on the beach, but tomorrow we have some fun stuff planned. I know I'm going on a hike at 7.30 a.m. tomorrow morning. It's actually not that late now. Everyone went to bed so early. It's only quarter to 11. I still feel wild, wild awake, wide awake. Um, but yeah, everyone went to bed really early. So I feel like I'm gonna get a good night sleep and then be hiking at 7.30 in the morning. So I'll see you bright and early and hope you have a good day guys. Bye.